can't decide if I'm a bigger fan of Reese with her spoon or Reese without her spoon. <laughs> Micro Jig, maker of the gripper. Work safer, work smarter. A long time traditional woodworking project is a carved wooden spoon. Most people use hand chisels and carving knives, but for my non-traditional spoons, I use nothing but power tools and every sander in my shop. I hope you enjoyed this week's art and design project. Well, I hope you enjoyed this week's rather artsy art and design video. I think the lounge music and the, the power tool sounds are, are metaphors for making utensils in a lounge. I don't plan on actually using these spoons. I guess you could say they're more like decorative or ceremonial spoons. If I were actually going to use them, I'd probably apply a mineral oil finish rather than tongue oil. But they look pretty cool and it was fun getting a chance to use the rotary tool to carve with. Oh, and in case you're wondering about the belt sander I threw away, it just finally stopped working. I've got a lot of use out of that over the past 
10 plus years, so it was about due for a new one. Hey, if you're new here, please take a moment to subscribe to Woodworking for Beer Mortals and please ring the notification bell so you won't miss a video. And if you're feeling extra artsy, be sure to check out the other videos in my art and design series. But if you're feeling a bit more pragmatic, check out my basics video all about sanding. I do a lot of sanding. Thanks for watching everybody, I'll see you next time.